Hi, uh, today I will cover registry design pattern. This registry design pattern is belongs to base patterns and this base patterns is belongs to patterns of enterprise application architecture. First we will see the explanation of uh, registry pattern. Uh, this is the explanation. A well known object that other objects can use to find common objects and services. Okay. And uh, second explanation is a registry is a global object okay so some kind of global object will be there uh, that other objects will use to find common objects and services and usually this registries are uh, implemented using singleton design pattern so what is singleton design pattern how to implement uh, singleton design pattern that i have created separate videos please log into my channel and uh, watch the singleton design pattern so that you will understand what is singleton design pattern Okay, so we will see one explanation of uh, this registry uh, design pattern so that you will understand this registry design pattern. So the registry will look like this. Okay, the registry is always like a key value pair and here uh, this customer object is a common service uh, which other object will use for their uh, business logic. Okay, so the registry will have a key value pair and here key is customer ID and value is customer object. Okay, so now in the registry has uh, uh, two customer object and uh, one customer object uh, represents uh, John information and uh, second customer object represent David information. So using the key uh, you can identify the corresponding customer object. Uh, so how customer object uh, uh, class will look like this okay so it will look like this uh, so it is a customer registry uh, suppose uh, we want to get uh, customer object John then what we have to do is we have to call this met method get customer and pass the customer ID as one so once you pass the customer ID as one uh, this method will return this customer object John suppose if you pass customer ID as uh, 2 then uh, this method will return customer object David. So in this way uh, from the registry you can uh, get the particular uh, customer object uh, which will be used by some other object for uh, some business purposes or business logic. Okay. Uh, suppose you want to add uh, some customer object uh, in the registry then what you have to do is uh, you have to call this add customer method. So you have to pass the ID uh, which is the key and uh, you have to pass the customer object which you want to add in the uh, registry okay usually uh, registry registries are implemented using some kind of uh, map either hash map or linked hash map like that okay so now if you read this sentence you will understand easily a well-known object here well-known object is registry that some other objects will use to find common objects in this case common object is customer object so some other object uh, they want this customer object for some business logic then they will uh, uh, they will call customer registry uh, get customer method to get the customer object so once they get the customer object they can access customer object uh, attributes uh, properties and methods all those things okay so this is about uh, registry design pattern and uh, thanks for watching bye